Hello, hard hats, and welcome back to Construction Simulator. Been working on putting these ceiling element concrete components in place. If you remember, well, you can see in the upper left hand corner, we had 24 to do. 20 of them are done, and yes, I am burning the midnight oil as well. It is uh, just past, well, it was just past midnight, but now it's 1 a.m. And a few people have asked in previous episodes to see a little bit of night work. And since I've been working through the night, I figured. You know what? We'll just keep on continuing working through the night and we'll watch the sunrise together while we build the VIP lounges. Uh, we are 38% done currently. Yeah, last episode we started around 6% done. Got up to about 30... Uh, was it 36%? Somewhere around there? <laughs> I don't know where we were. But uh, we're now currently at 38% and probably soon, maybe 40% after I get this uh, section done. If it does get to be where I have trouble seeing what the heck I'm doing, what it, currently I have no problem seeing what I'm doing. Don't know what's going to happen with YouTube by the time I render this and upload it to YouTube. Sometimes they make it darker than what I'm seeing. But, uh, yeah, currently I'm having no problem seeing what I'm doing. All right, one more ought to do it. And then we have all that material over there is still the move to do whatever we needed to be doing with it. Don't know if I got any more pouring of the concrete to do. But we did a lot last episode. Of course, we had to do the foundation, the pillars, and all that stuff. Uh, yeah, pouring concrete. Pour the slab. I can see it right there. And actually, uh, is my pump actually might be ready to go right there. Isn't that where I got it parked? Actually, I don't even see the boom sticking up in the air. Well, there's the crane. Oh, no, I, I remember now. <laughs> yeah, uh, I parked it on the other side of the road with the mixer there they are I mean we knew where it was around just a matter of where it wasn't and actually we did, you know since I don't really ever do any night work you know we, we don't really get to see the night sky in construction simulator oh there's the galaxy the Milky Way galaxy right there interesting uh, but yeah we don't have time to stare at the stars we need to keep on working. Oh, watch out for the road signs. Uh, wait, can I get... Uh, let's see, I'm just trying to find a way in. Let's go ahead and park her. Probably next to the crane, honestly. Um, yeah, we're going to park it right here. Because I think we got to pour all the way over to here, did we not? Ish. Well, we're going to find out here in a second. Did I leave myself enough room to put, th put these down? Uh, I, think I, heard a, I think I heard a thud. I didn't say it was blocked, but it wouldn't let me get out. It wouldn't do anything, so... I mean, let's just go ahead and move the crane anyways. I don't think... I'm going to need it for anything currently. Now let's try this. Actually, you know what? I am going to move this a little bit over. Because if I don't, I won't be able to reach the far end, and that's going to really suck. This right there, that should allow me to get everything, I think. Oop, I'm on the camera. Let's get off the camera and extend the boom. Probably be morning by the time this thing fully extends, right? I 
I know a few people said it's easier to work closer that than go far away. I prefer, as we all know at this point, work far away and then move it closer. All right, the hopper is open. Let's uh, show my athletic skills by jumping up here. Oh, almost made it up on that. Almost. And I think the mixer is actually completely empty. Is it not? Yep, it's empty. Actually, that might be the cement mixing plant right there. Am I actually near a plant? Gravel plant. Don't run into my crane. A little bit more. There we go. Perfect. Uh, fill her up. And turn the pouring on. Alright. I think we'll get this all complete without having to move. Actually, you know what? There might be uh, lights. Alright. Headlights. Rotating lights. Warning lights, turn off all lights. Well, it's headlights. Rotating lights. Warning. Do we not have any work lights? Alright. I mean, they're not doing me no good up here. Turn them all off, I guess. Whoop. Now, let's get back to work. Oh, it's going to be sloppy work. Oh, it sounds like the birds are coming to life. Well, I mean, they were alive. They were just sleeping. But the suns are rising. And so is my temper with the concrete pump, probably. I'm going too fast for it. No, 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 no. Let's not fold up. I mean, that's kind of my fault. I am a little bit too close. Ah. All right, let me just work around it. If I have to get closer to the truck... I'll work the boom a little bit better. Didn't think I was that close to cause that issue to happen, but... We all know I don't get along with this thing. Although I have seen some comments where some people are starting to admit that they have issues with the pumps as well. And I'm sure there's some experts out there that'll be like, yeah, they're so easy though. All right, fill it up and pouring on. So, ooh, I got 24% done. Couldn't have been like 26%, so that means I would only have to fill it up a couple more times, but no. The corner, please. I got that song in my head now. Here comes the sun.
taking a lot of concrete. Alright, almost made... <laughs> I almost said made our first headland like it's Farming Simulator. Yeah, how are we doing? 42%. So we know we're getting kind of close to where the mixer is going to be running out of material in just a moment. And pretty soon we're going to see that yellow circle on the right hand side disappear really quick. Almost halfway there. Still think we'll get the job completed without having to move the pump. Almost to the other side. Yeah, now we made it to the other side. All right, bring it in a little bit. Now work our way back again. Imagine if I went back to using the keyboard and mouse, how difficult this would be to me. It's almost like full concentration mode when I got to use the controller for this pump. So many pivot points on this boom. Why, why did you fold up there for? Don't don't start. I don't know why you would have folded up that far out. Why are you folding up like in that position? I don't know. What? what uh, there must be a secret to this thing sometimes because I, I or, or the pump just does not like me at all. One or the other. I'm not sure why it's folding up that far extended. A couple times I thought it was doing that because the end was like kind of into the floor, but I've, I've really jammed it into the floor before. It's never folded up, so yeah, I don't know. Let's just see if we can get the last 30% done here without having any, any more issues here, but I'm sure we're going to. One, once the pump starts doing that on me, it's going to be a long uh, remaining job. Why? Just why? All right. Um, <laughs> this is going to be, I can think it's going to be a struggle to get the last 27%. So bear with me. 
Let's just try to get without. I'm not. I'm not going to try to move the boom too much, other than side to side. Let's hope we get enough of it done. Yeah, I'm not quite sure I know what the secret is to this thing at, the, at this point. As I mentioned before, I would just love to have where it's a button where it folds in the end of the boom and unfolds it rather than it doing it automatically, but... Try to get as much as we can so I don't have to fold in too much. Alright, eleven percent more. But we are gonna run out of mixture before I get to the end anyways, I know that much. Was it gonna be like at ninety-five percent when I run out? Yep, we're running out. I'm glad we can pour the concrete that high up. <laughs> Probably splattering everyone on the job site with the concrete. I'm actually surprised it hasn't folded up on me just yet, but I shouldn't have said nothing because now that I said it, it probably will. Yep, 97% is swinging around here. You're gonna make me try to fold it in to get this little piece over here, aren't you? Come on, 100%. Let's do it. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. That is a, a lot of uh, prefabricated wall element timber I got to move and pallet of metal elements, not so much. All right, let's turn off the uh, mixture so we don't hear that for a while. All right, this prefab wall element timber, is this something I gotta go get, or is it gonna be here? Uh, I don't see it, so this could be something I'm gonna have to go get, but let's go ahead and move these uh, elements around. So it wants three of them, and that's half of what we have. And I think I saw where they need to go. It's going to be a lot of trips down with the man truck to the prefab building. But you gotta do what you gotta do to get paid.
What if they're gonna make me run up to the second floor to unpackage this material? Or I could just run around to the other side of the building where I've been going up the steps anyways. Watching where the crane needs to go, not actually watching where the crane was. Probably the best place to park my truck when I bring the walls back might be over here by the mixer and the pump. I was wondering if they're going to have me go up there and unpackage that stuff, but it looks like that's a no. Uh, no, that's the wrong button. Uh, this button here, and my truck is going to be... There it is. Uh, while I'm over here, this truck should be in repair mode. And I'm only doing it just to try to level up our company. Because i got to do it... I forgot how many times i got to do it. All right, prefab walls, build, building yard, steel trade. Oh wait, this is probably it, there we go. Let's just fast travel there. I don't know how many packages it's gonna be, but it's gonna be quite a bit. Uh, let's go get into the loading zone. Now we're running around front. Number of packages, 13. Seven for the stage we're on and six for the other one. So we'll purchase those. We'll load one, two, and I think that's going to be it. All right. So, yeah, we're going to be making a few trips down here. The rest of the episode might be me putting in these. Because there's nothing else I can do in this stage. It's not like uh, do a little bit of this. and It's like there's not going to be another option to do something else. Uh, wait, where are we going? Way up here. But let's get these walls started at least. Uh, yeah, I want to, I want to go on the other side, although I just remember, don't park too far over to the left because the crane cannot reach that far. Okay, now what we need to do is unpackage these. Nope, didn't get it. Okay, third time was a charm on that one. One, two, three, four. Oh, well, we're trying. <laughs> Come on now. Oh, this is like a lot of... There we go. <laughs> that may have been... Uh, I think that was over a dozen, honestly. I, I was spamming that button near the end there. All right. Uh, yeah, jump over that. Uh, fall down onto the scaffolding or get stuck on it. All right. I'm not Superman. I can't leap over tall buildings, apparently. All right, so I'm guessing we got eight on the truck. Four for each. Is 
Well, let's start making some sweets, shall we? So we got a wall with like a door opening. Uh, that looks like it could go here. But apparently not. Alright. Alright, so it wants to be that one. I'm going to have to use my camera quite a bit. I can see that. But the good thing is, as I get walls in, that just leaves less and less chances for me to figure out where it needs to go. Uh, I think this one's lit up. Nope. I'm wrong. Alright, where's the camera? Alright. Are, are they being very picky of which ones they want it to be? Although I think the one I was just trying to put in was a double wall. Okay, where do you want to go? Okay, you want to go way over there. Gotcha. No, over here. Just making sure that one was connected before I released it. Alright. Oh, you're going to actually let me just put this one anywhere then? Alright. Solid wall. I see this one lit up, so we're going to go ahead and drop this one here. And this spot looks good. See if I let me put it in this one here. Looks like it will. And how about the one right in front of us? Alright, might as well leave the crane right there. Uh, is there a way just to run through this building? Yep, that'll work. Alright, uh... Alright, this, uh, this one's gonna be tricky, apparently. Nope, I think I got it on that one. Fifth time was a charm. Not having much luck today with these. Oh, there we go. I can see the camera doing the shimmy shake. All right. Let's head on back and we'll grab another set. So there were seven. We grabbed two of them. All right. So we got, we, like I said, we got a few trips. And this is just for this stage here. make sure that the trailer is completely in the loading zone.
and select and load package load package I'll be back to see you later ma'am just like in real life my guy is so much out of shape and back up to here only 165 credits to travel from there to there worth it Ah, just follow my tire tracks. Make sure we're not parked underneath the concrete pump, though. Alright. Let's see if I can uh, uncrate these at a good... That's one try. Alright, third try. Alright, so I'm kind of just... Can I walk to the side here and get it? Apparently not. Oh, there we go. Alright, three tries. That wasn't too bad. Uh, I don't know how I got over here last time, but this looks like a good way to go. Or maybe not. Let's not get lost in the building. All right. Process of elimination. We got eight walls in. Uh, I think this one's going to let me put it here. We'll just do a counterclockwise move around the building until we find out where it wants to go. I mean, I should, probably should use the camera to find it. Oh, here's a spot. Should go here. Uh, a double. All right, we got a double right here. Trying to take a mental image of the building as I go around of where some ghost images are and where I need to be going. But my brain is this not... I can see one way up in the front, but now that I'm way back here... Oh, interesting. It wants to go here? We can see we got a lot of, like, single walls that we're going to be picking up here in the future. Alright, I do believe there's a couple of these right up on the other side by the crane. The crane side. Well, there's actually one right here. Well, we're halfway done with the stage at least. Yeah, looks like I got a couple more to go over here. I actually probably will take the whole. Uh, do you really want to go on the other side now? Probably do. Well, just go in one of them. I, I don't care which one. Just go go somewhere. And the last one, might as well, oh, no, that's a, okay, we got a double, uh, double door, I guess, or a window.
Let's see, where do we got? Uh, I see one up front again. I kind of forgot about that one. Let's work way around. That's a single win. Oh, uh, will it go here? I don't think it wants to, actually. I don't think this one's lit up. No, it's not. So, it's got to go in the one in the front. The only one I see lit right now, so let's just go ahead and put it there. Hopefully I can find my way through the building. Uh, nope. <laughs> Alright, let's get rid of these. Come on. Fine. Okay, there we go. Ah, first try. Oh, I thought I had it. What? My my guy uh, freaked out on it. All right, they're gone. <laughs> All right, and uh, nope, over here. Still got one more trip after this one. Because there should be three of them left when we go to the... Go see the lovely lady inside the prefab wall building. Try loading the last one? No. Okay. Didn't hurt to try. Most are going to say, are you stupid? Yes, I, I, I am. <laughs> Alright. Let's get back up to here. This job also might not be too bad to do as the sun sets because the ghost images are going to show up just a little bit better with the sun going down. Okay, you freaked out again. Hey, okay. Second try after I freaked out, and then uh, he unlocked it. And third try on that one. I mean, considering the way it's been going, that's not too bad. All right. What do we got here? All right, we're starting to get some of the single frames, I guess we can call them. And wherever you want to go, all right. Got a door here, a solid over there. The building is coming together. I mean, we would hope so. It's better than coming apart, but with my building skills, you never know. Uh, a lot of solid walls there. Solid wall. I think you would fit right here perfectly. And then again, I'd be wrong. That's uh, okay. All right, now I see where you need to go.
Right, I think this piece here is where I thought that piece could have gone. So I'm going to bring that just straight back. Yeah, that's where this is going. And actually, we got one just like it. it. Needs to go to the left of that. My poor worker's been working almost 36 straight hours. No coffee breaks. Right, you, I think, are going to go way over here. So we do know we got more packages on another stage to do, so probably another floor after this. Sure it gets on that side. Oh, I said on that side of the scaffolding, please. Got to be a little bit more precise with that one. But well, we got it in. So I'm assuming the last one I gotta go get for the stage is this gonna have two pieces in it. I mean, if we can all count. <laughs> we, yeah, we can see it's gonna just need two more pieces. Uh, where are these going? Oh, probably over on this side. here somewhere. There it is. Let's get the crane back over here and we'll make a trip down to get those two pieces there, I suppose. Uh, nope. Yep. Starting on my way around. Alright, first I gotta get rid of these though. Come on, dude. You got it. Let me try this one over here. I was doing so good for a while with these. Now, all of a sudden today, these are... I can't find the sweet spots. Wow, these don't want to come off at all. My guy's probably saying, yeah, because I've been working 36 straight hours almost without a break. Uh... 
Wow, this is starting to get just a little bit frustrating. Almost much so with like the concrete pumps. There he goes. <laughs> I don't know. Not sure I'm finding the sweet spots today at anything, but all right. Uh, let's head on down to. And before someone says, I did change my battery in my controller, I think a couple weeks ago. Wait, when I was doing a paving job. So it's been a while, actually. But the battery in my controller seems to be fine. Get the last one done so we can get the stage done. Um, nah, it doesn't matter. I was like, maybe I should load one up, but then now it still leaves five, which means I still got to make three trips down here. So either way, I got to make three more trips. And if I add another one on now, I may get confused of which one will well, be the one with two in it. It doesn't matter. I'm still going to make three trips no matter what. Not like it's that big of a deal. We're just fast traveling, so... <laughs> so a little bit of night work in this episode, because a few people have asked for a little, a little bit of it. All right, let's see how my luck is at uh, on creating this one. Ah, second try. That's not too bad. take just a second then I probably will take a coffee break we'll go to morning my guy needs a break I'm not gonna get much of one because uh, he's gonna sleep about six hours Our kid and yeah, sleep till morning. All right, a fresh day. Uh, I thought about taking the scaffolding, but I think we'll just take the stairs. One. Oh, now we got frames to walls being put in behind us. At least these are uncrating on the first try. Now we're probably going to have to move those concrete uh, slabs over so we can put more roofing on. And we get paid, which is nice. Alright, so... Five, and we got five ghost images there, so everything's going on this side. And that's all we have are five of them. So,
Look at that, they almost line up without having to move the crane too much. But hey, we finally made it to 50% done. I think. I'm not sure I can trust those percentages ever. I don't know if it's doing it by steps or if it's doing it by time. I don't think it does it by time because that doesn't seem... That never, never seems to add up. And after this one, probably going to have to put some of the ceilings up. And depending how many are going to sh it's going to show me to do, I may do the same as I did between episodes from last one to this one to get most of them done. So we are getting kind of close to the one hour time. Unpackaged material. No surprise. Is it this material? Though? Yes, it is. Okay. Uh, but it wants me to do the middle one. Eighteen. Nope. Twenty-eight. <laughs> All right. Well, we'll do a couple of them, and then I'll have to get most of these done in between episodes, and then uh, we'll do the last two together. So we'll do the first two, then the last two. How about that? So overall, not a bad day. I mean, we fought with the concrete pump a little bit. And then making a lot of trips on down to the prefab wall building. But uh, we're getting there. Uh, we're over halfway done now. Hurrah. Hooray. Um, but yeah, we got a lot more building to do, it, it seems like. I think we got seven more prefab walls. Or sorry, six more prefab walls. We got Odon grab. So I'm pretty sure after I get the ceiling done here, it'll be another floor to get on done. Uh, concrete might actually be done with that because now we're putting a wood ceiling in. Uh, we'll have to wait and see, but uh, yeah. One step at a time, we shall get there. No, can't go in there. All right. Uh, my guy probably needs a break anyways. But anyways, uh, if you made it this far in the video and you like what you saw, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. It helps up the channel more than you know. And if you haven't already and you think about doing so, please do subscribe as well. But that is where we're going to wrap it up for today. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. I do appreciate you watching as always. I'll catch you again right here in Construction Simulator. But until then, have a good one.